What's up guys, Chasing Lamey here with episode 24 of The Journey. We're back in Sweden for uh, the more fantastic fourth tier action. So, like, subscribe, ring the bell, and let's go catch up on what we've missed. So, of course, we last met in this game against Ostersunds. We then played Frosher, uh, which I think is how you pronounce those errs. Uh, no nil draw, nothing really doing. Uh, played Gutnit at uh, at their place, and uh, well, two nil loss was not a great success. So I tweaked the tactics again. I've been fiddling with the tactics. Uh, played Friskavior with a new four three one two narrow. Beat them four one. Goal from Pedrini, Jakob Romo Schiller, and Philip Ekman. We then beat Hudiksvalls four three. A hat trick from Jakob Romo Schiller. And a goal from new signing Noah Nacrion. If you've not met yet, he's joined us on loan from uh, Tarby, but obviously came through Dijon and Nice originally in France. He is, of course, a French, and he's a very good little player as an attacking midfielder. So we're going to meet him, get to uh, get to see him in action properly. Today we'll play Bidale. Uh Hopefully they're seventh in the league. They're right behind us. As uh, as the league table goes, by the way, we are currently sitting in fifth. We have a game in hand on third. Uh, fourth are playing today as well. If we win today, we'd be within two points of Hudix Files in third and still very much in the fight for the top of the table. So good things all around. So let's go meet the lineup today, see what we can achieve. Hopefully it's something special because uh, that will be nice. I'll uh, figure out a team selection at some stage. Uh, in fact, I think I've redone the team selection. I've not recorded for a couple of days. Have I done this already? I have done this team selection already. I've sat and I've properly thought this through. So, starts down today, then it's going to be Kino Miguel Maya in goal. He's currently our first choice uh, because the guy we did have, uh, Francini, has left us. Uh, we've got Kepnang, Ekman, Faley, and Tork at the back. Padrino, Falma, and Oscar Carlson in central midfield. Noah Necron in the central attacking midfield role. Uh, Padrini and Schilla up top. We've got Kasper Jensen, Jens Forsmark, Philip Sherberg, Bendik Oss, who is a new signing, uh, Manya Eren, uh, Marwan Shafar, and Oscar Folds making up the bench. So we have the option to go to wingers if we need to, but I feel like this is probably going to be quite effective as a tactical plan. So without any further ado, let's firm that and let's go see if we can get a result against Pateo. So here in the dressing room then we're going to do a we're doing well, we're a good run, let's keep that going shall we? That's done absolutely nothing of, uh, of note at all, so we'll uh, we'll do a bit of a play without any pressure, didn't do anything great, good stuff, okay, we're just going to tell everyone to be strong, be good, be better, and hopefully we'll get something out of this game, that will be a great plan, no inspiration at all, apparently our powers to inspire have abandoned us at this stage, Okay, so we're in our 4-3-1-2 that we have uh, have seen already. And Piteo are lining up in a 3-4-2-1, which uh, they don't seem confident, do they? Um, we can, as I said before, get up into fourth today. We can be in touching distance of the top two, which is where we need to be at the end of the season for this one to be successful, I think is safe to say. And, uh, well, we're underway, so hopefully goals, they'll be a coming. Corner and Torp will be the ones to take it for us. Into the box, looking for Romo Schiller. Anderson heads it away, but Torp picks it back up. Cross the box for Padrino. Back to Ekman, to Kepnang. Kepnang with a chance to run out the now. Will he have a pop? He does have a pop. And Eriksson tips it over the bar. Oh, no, he doesn't tip it over the bar. It went over the bar just because Kepnang whacked it high and wide. The, uh, the tactic seems to be doing what I want it to do, which is nice, as Torp gets a throw in. 28 minutes on the clock, Carlson back to Torp, into the box, looking for Romo Schiller. Romo Schiller gets his head to it, and it's 14th goal of the season, if it had stood, which it didn't. So, uh, I guess we just carry on. Free kick, Romo Schiller to take it from deep into the box, looking for Nacrion. And uh, now Johansson has picked up the ball. Nord running at us. We are not defending very well. Johansson's got the beating of defence here. I don't know who that is running across, but they need to do something. That was was not it. Bringes puts it into the box. Kepnan gets it clear to Ui Bazazi or Babsi. I don't know. Can't pronounce that. Nord to Thompson to Bergen. 
or Berglin, sorry, to Nord with a pop from range, and Meyer, I mean, I think he had it covered, but it's gone out wide and it's gone for a corner, so he must have had it covered. Nord takes the corner. Can we win this in the air? I would like to think we can. Uh, we haven't done much with it, though, so I guess we just carry on regardless. Half time about to be upon us. We've got time to kind of tidy things up a little bit, see how things go. It's been a very close game, not much in the way of goal scoring opportunities. Uh, proud of everyone of opportunities so far. Keep going, we can win this. In fact, let's just do a, you've got the ability to make a difference with everyone. Let's see if that does anything massively, uh, except for the attackers. Let's have a little, little chat with our attackers here. Do the individual, uh, individual little talks here and just say I'm not happy with your performance. Though. They seem motivated. Beautiful stuff. Okay, second half underway. Johansson plays it to Thompson, to Nord for Pateo. And they're coming straight at us now as Ui Babazzi runs at us. And uh, Volvene to Weston to Berg, uh, Berglin, sorry, to Nord, Nord cross for Bringers, who will bring us, sorry, to Anderson, come on, win this back boys, let's try some defending, that'd be nice if we could just do a defending, I don't know why we're appeal appealing for offside, you were stood behind him, you absolute clown, you were stood behind him, why were you trying to get an offside decision, you fool, like, at what stage did these guys here, our number five here, at what stage did he think anyone was offside? At what stage? There was no one offside at any stage there. Absolutely nonsense. Anyway, we've got a goal down, so we need to fire the boys up and try and produce something from this. And, uh, well, it's going to have to come from somewhere special. As Ericsson takes a goal kick, let's try and keep this down to 1-0 if we can. Bring gas. Let's get back behind the ball, boys. Come on, we can do this. Anderson's through. Anyone want to try defending? Failey tried defending, and he's given away a penalty. And it's going to be 2-0, because uh, that's just the way our luck goes. We've just not been very good at all. Johansson's going to take it, and uh, puts it away. And I need to do some tacticking, because this is not working. And I'm not a fan of it, so... Uh, I'm going to go figure something else out. I think that's going to be the plan. I'm going to get a replay of the penalty. I thought we'd already had the replay. I felt like it took forever. Good, good. I'm going to go fix this. Okay, I swear I don't know why I think this is a good idea. But we've gone to three at the back. We've gone to three lopsided in midfield. With two ahead of them, two up top. And I think you know, we'll, uh, we'll just try and go positive and hope results come goals come something comes because uh well yeah the uh the front two were doing nothing valmore was doing nothing the defense was barely passable so we're going to hope for something to happen here that's sort of my plan thompson picks up the ball for piteo across to the back post for bring us over the bar we very need to get ourselves back in this game and uh, that's going to require some very outside the box thinking for the boys it's got to be said so uh, I guess we just kind of hope for the best as Maya now gets himself a goal kick to Jansen. Forward, looking for folds to Oss. Oss has time. Goes forward looking for Overgaard, Christiansen, Anderson to Berglin to Thompson to Johansson to bring us. And they've got through our defence already. That has gone perfectly, exactly as I planned. And, uh, well, Nord has headed it over the bar. And, uh, yeah, this is... Uh, <sighs> The 4-3-1-2 looks so good up until this point. I don't know why it suddenly decided not to be good. As uh, Nacleon has picked up the ball back to Maya. Maya goes forward now with the ball at his feet, apparently. Folds, heads it down for Nacleon, who... What was that? Lordy. Thompson to Johansson. Johansson through to Nord. Nord is through on goal. Nord has a pop from range, and luckily Nord's shooting was not super strong. Because I think we'd have been powerless to stop that if that had been of any use whatsoever. Corner, Nord for Pateo. I've just realised this is a local derby as well. Good stuff. Andreasen, uh, Arroyo is trying to get the ball back. Johansson with a pop from distance. And, uh, well, that hit everything except the back of the net as, uh, well, the inside of the back of the net. I say, ten minutes to go. I've gone to a 3-3-3-1 three, 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 with wingers because I didn't know what else to do. I'm hoping it will inspire something, although Nacleon probably should be doing something slightly more uh, shadow strikery from that position. I would think that's probably a little bit smarter. We're going to play for set pieces as well. 
and hopefully this will lead to something as Maya gets a chance to play from feet. Bailey forward to Oss who has moved to being a central midfielder now to Carlson. Carlson to Nacreon. Nacreon turns his man looking to create something if he can. Plays it back to Faley. Faley forward back to Nacreon who's drifted out wide inside looking for Carlson and it's with Aaron. Falls from range and nothing doing. There are no goals to come for us today, apparently. We are, yeah, we have let ourselves down a little bit. I'm going to try and fire the boys up, but we've not been very good at all today. It's got to be said. We've got a corner. That's nice. Padrino will take it. Can we get a consolation goal from this one? I have inside forwards filling the box. Ekman is there. And hopefully that's going to count. It's got the look of a not going to count, but maybe it does. It does count. It's 2-1. That's worked out beautifully. And, uh, well, we have got ourselves almost back in the game. Can we steal a point here and uh, really, really take advantage of this? I don't think we'll be able to, but, you know, never say never as, uh, as injury time ticks away. It looks like it's probably over. There we go. We've lost 2-1. And... Uh, that's not great for our season, it's got to be said. I don't like what I just saw from this team. It is a fair reaction because I didn't like what I saw from this team. In fact, let's take some uh, some individuals who have underperformed today. Let's give them a little uh, let's give them a little bit of a, a talking to, shall we? We'll tell them that was not acceptable. Please do not do that again. Uh, you didn't play well enough today. They seem very motivated. Good stuff. Okay, we're happy with that. We like it. Okay, so coming back is going to be interesting because there is the African Championship of Nations qualifying happening right now, uh, which I did consider coming back for. But A, I realise this competition is not that important because you can only pick players who play in Africa for it. Second, I didn't fancy playing Niger and having the, U the YouTube algorithm decide I couldn't spell and I needed banning so uh, we're gonna skip that we're gonna come back actually for Nigeria and Zimbabwe games with Benin as things go for store for us we're gonna come back actually about the same week for that one uh, we'll come back for the farm Sveden's game which is just after those chron chronologically so we'll play the next two World Cup qualifiers Come back with Kfarns, friends. I'm going to stick with the 4 3 one, 2 for a little while just to see if it produces anything useful for us. And uh, yeah, we'll try and get ourselves through to the end of the season. That feels like a good plan. And then we'll figure out what we do from there because we're out of contract. Maybe it's time to find a regular, you know, autumn to, to summer season. Who knows? We'll find out. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Have as always been Chasing Lenny. Don't forget to like, subscribe, ring the bell, all that good stuff. Leave those comments down below. Uh, don't forget to share with your friends because it all helps me out and I'm trying to get to a 1,000 subs. If I get to a 1,000 subs, then maybe I can do something fun. Who knows? Crazy. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you all very soon. Till next time, stay safe and uh, have a good one.